Everyone's just waiting for me to freaking come back. Okay. Yes, this is the beginnings of Florida. Yes, we, I mean, Edward Kenway would 100% be a Florida man. The, the Florida man, Florida. Yeah, I went on so many roller coasters. I'm so happy that you're proud of me. Okay. Yeah! All right. I would love to go kind of over here, but I don't think that they're... Wish me luck. If there were actual assassins in Florida, you know who would be dead by now. Florida would be like a, a truly magical place because assassins would have killed those motherfuckers. Requiescat in pace, Ron DeSantis. Yes. No Unifex, but I saw that uh, Power Washer is <laughs> releasing a DLC or something with Warhammer. So that's all I know of it. I need to kill more people and board more ships, steal more ships, steal more cargo because I need jewels. You know. I'm so excited for the Spongebob DLC. They can take all my money. I'm obsessed. Bum, bum, bum. Kill it! Kill it to death. Kill it to death. Diplomacy. Don't forget, outfitting the ship is really important. Chase cannons. Oh, nice. Let's get it. Hell yeah. I don't even know what's next on the... Oh, wait, I can craft the shark hunter outfit. <laughs> They're just so happy. They're so ecstatic. That was a good upgrade, huh? I'm going to make the shark hunter outfit. Lady Crazy Nut. Hi. Oh, let's sell too. I bet I have some sugar. Oh, I'm not going to be able to afford anything. Anything? Okay. I want red sails. Where'd all the rum go exactly? 
I'm like complaining about being broke and I'm buying red sales. Oh, shit. Okay. <gasps> ah, I'm misunderstanding. Did you change? Oh. Oh. Hi, Tom. <laughs> this is a cosmetic. Oh. Okay, I think that's sexy. I think this is sexy as as Fuck. And he's barefoot? Basically? Unifex, thank you for gifting us such a gem. Oh no, he has shoes on. One subscription to jam underscore pack. Thank you. Thank you so much. Who's main sale? Thank you. Thank you. Ooh, I like this one. I haven't heard it. Unifex. Unifex one gifted a tier one subscription <laughs> to salty underscore Nutella. <laughs> Nutella. Thank you so much for gifting a sub to Salty. As I sail, as I sail, as I sail, as I sail, as I sail. <laughs> okay, I guess let's go over there. Um. Do you guys think that I can get that fort yet? <laughs> the range. I am playing on PC with an Xbox controller. Uh, let's look for... How do I know what's a level one fort? And where would these animals be? Someone was very obsessed with me getting the sea shanty here. Oh, it's right here. Oh, it'll tell. Okay, cool. Thank you, guys. Hey, Ladrin. He looks so cute. 
it looked old. I think this is very fancy. I don't really have a problem with old games, though, unless they're just like physically very clunky. Um, but I don't know. It's I think it's because I missed out on so many games growing up. He smashed that. Oh, I see. Nice. Okay, and these are where the animals are too, so I'll go hunting a little bit. If you see a rabbit, let me know. Oh. Poor pig. What even is that? Alyssa, happy birthday! Happy birthday! I hope you have a great birthday. Hey! No! Get back here, bitch! We're happy to spend it with you for sure. Yeah! I got the last one! I hope that person's very excited. Leave her, Johnny! Ooh, I feel like that one's gonna be sassy. Does anyone see any pigs? Happy birthday, Northern Lights! So many birthdays! I'm gonna go to... Hey! I am warning you. Secrets. Gemini. Hell yeah. I love me a Gemini. I really do. I really, really do. A Sagittarius, we love a Gemini. We love you crazy sons of bitches. <laughs> Hi kittens. Welcome back, Viking. It's true. <laughs> nice. Okay. Crocodile. Oh my God, I'm scared, but I want to. Have I killed crocodiles yet? I'm getting the Assassin's Creed mixed up. He's probably so stinky right now. Does anyone see a crocodile? Oh my god, I lost it. Special as when Connor did it. <laughs> just, we're just 
pew pewing. <laughs> Why is he shooting them? Couldn't you get a nice bow and arrow? You crazy mf -er. Hi, Disney. Good to see you. Pistol ammo pouch. Nice. That's perfect. Um, What is this? Is this a warehouse? Let's do that one. Let's go there. Y'all have been telling me warehouse, warehouse, warehouse. And I'm like, I don't know. I don't know where the house is. Just kidding. The crocodiles were terrifying in Red Dead. Oh my God. That was, that was really something. That can't be legal. Happy belated birthday, Ege! So many Geminis! He looks extra Florida man <laughs> in this outfit. I love it. Gemini pirates. Yes. There he is. Oh, he had the key. Oops. I'm gonna get so much money. Oh, there are multiple keys. Oh. Oh, no, 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 no. I didn't mean to do that. I am a non 
anonymous. No one knows who I am. Back to the ship. I love that you can get to your ship by all these little boats. Goblin shark. I've never heard of gotten goblin shark. Yes. Oh, I can't even do anything. Whoa, 23 sugar. Yes, that's good money. That is good, good money. I don't care about fire barrels. Okay, let's do a quest, main quest. Oh. Just sail to the damn sea, okay? Sail to the sea. I can't. Oh. Damn. There's so much. You said I could make pistol ammo pouch. Oh, it's unavailable at this time. Okay. Give us a 
Ashanti. Aloft, lads! Check those royals! This is the new one we got. I love this one. We're gonna get this guy. Wait, is it a nice ship? Now, I'm not no. Up she rises, way. Well, Fire! no, the <laughs> no more firing. We're just going to get this loot. Stop singing. I'm embarrassed. Storm looks bad. Okay. I'm trying my best. I accidentally shot. Starboard, come on. Cast away. Adrift in the road. Okay. <laughs> they interrupted the shanty. They must pay with their lives. Bye, Tom. What the hell's happened here? Were you attacked? <laughs> Other way around. It were Blackbeard who struck first. Open fire on a British man of war, the pillar. What in God's name for? Still searching for Yeah, medicines. that was him. But he's gone bar me, if you ask me. That was him. I'll bring him home. Yeah, yeah, Leave yeah. Him, man. He's heaped this trouble on himself. Oh, <laughs> interesting. So I knew, I, I knew I was going to have to rescue survivors. How? What do you mean? 
uh, like board the ship. Uh, how? Do I rescue them? I did have a premonition. Um. <laughs> oh, wait. Oh, okay, 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 okay. Why does it have a blue? Oh, because it's the marker. Oh. Okay. Sorry, guys. Sorry. Um. Never mind. Just, just never mind. Bye, Jedi. <laughs> Bumble, thank you for the two gift subs. Howdy, howdy. How you doing? How's it going? Thank you, thank you. Pistol ammo pouch. Jesus. Where can I crap? I think I have to finish the mission. Captain's home. Loose and trim two. It's going so good. Today has been really fun, Bumble. I'm glad that you're doing well, too. Uh oh. Oh, shit. Okay, I almost hit that place. Oh. Captain, so there's a wreck yonder. Looks oh. recent. I see it. Let's hope Thatch hasn't come to the same end. Brief the topsails and gallants. Another bit of wreckage, Captain. This is looking grim. Aye. Keep your eyes peeled. Blast. This is getting well out of hand. A dozen crates of medicine should not be so hard to come back. That ain't my meaning. It's Thatch and Hornigold and this pointless feud of theirs. Can't you feel it? I do. Aye. But both men have their hearts in a good place. Aww. Both want the best for the people of Nassau. But it's uh -huh. the best course for us. Saving a city that ain't worth much. We're not men made to govern. We take and spend and live heartily wherever we go. What solution would you propose? The answer's in wealth and power, not confidence. If we found the observatory, we'd see enough money to buy the whole of England. Or it might be we'd lord over these kingdoms and emperors like they was peasants themselves. A lot of large talk, Captain. But is it your crew you sail for or yourself? I mean the best for these men. I do. This don't sit well. I'm running errands, not living my life. Oh. Lawrence, pass the way. Think he's alive, sir? All sail. She'll take it. Right. All I love the conversations he has with Ade. I feel like he's his most honest with him. So is this? Oh shit! Okay. okay let's go. No, you. Hey, I 
wanted to go there. Send to Kenway's fleet. This looks like a good one. Yes, even if I salvage it. Yeah. <laughs> okay, well, we're gonna have to fight again. Probably. Wind is shaping up for a big blow, sir. Slow down, take some wind. It's like one of the best animations ever. So cute. We get the fucking <sighs> upgrades. Okay, this is hard. Come here. Hi, Sug. How you doing? Civilians? Who? What do you mean? Soldiers happened to go to church yesterday. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Um, I'm thinking let's repair. <laughs> yeah. Okay. More ships. Give me some speed. Stop, stop. So, I'm going to this green part. run let's run ah oh no i know josh groban thank you for gifting yourself josh groban stream out gifted a tier one subscription to the community thank you thank you so much I hope you're doing well. Good to see you. Coming! Ghost 
Oh no, oh no! Mains up, let's go! Round it all on! Come on, you slugs, man those sheeps! Damn, okay. Well, um, how am I going to repair? I know, right? And I'm looking for thatch. Am I supposed to kill them? Oh. Hmm. There it is. We found it. See that? It's her captain, the Queen Anne's Revenge. And she's in a bad way. No time for a vote. Thatch is outnumbered. The crew will understand. Beat the quarters, lads. We're sailing into hell! Oh. Unfold, mates. Let's move. Get up those shrouds. Let's move. Call them in. Get off the wind. Pull. Pull all sail. Do you hear the news? Thatch is overwhelmed. I'm going ashore. No! That's my buddy! Steve! Oh God. Hang in there, boy! Oh shit, I didn't mean to do that. Remember that. You stirred up a nest of trouble, Fat. In service of the cause. Medicines, I hope you mean. Hi, a galleon nearby. Okay. If we crash this lot, we might catch up to her. I'm getting the hang of it. Oh no. <laughs> okay. Oh yeah, I'll happily drive this one. He's letting me drive his car.
Those are buddies. He's four. Oh, it wanted me to go. Okay, sorry. Shite. You'll be hanged and sun dried just as them there were in Boston. The king's called for a pardon. <laughs> we're killing That's the a, English. We the hold. It's a middle intake. But the medicine we found bears a Charles Town stamp. Thank you, Mr. A little bird told me that something. We cannot resupply Nassau out here by force and accident alone. We should go to Charlestown for the lot. I cannot believe Hello. I've been here for almost a year, uh, D. Are we victorious? Thank you, Captain. I fear I am not built for the fatigue Thank and care you. required to live as a man of fortune. Meet me in Charlestown. One month from today. Charlestown. Oh. Oh. Celtic, we have a stream baby. That was so fun. I'm feeling more powerful. It was challenging at first. This is great. In one month. So we got shit to do. <laughs> um, that was so fun. Have I been there? So Charlestown. Or wait. Yeah. Let's, let's, let's gain money medium. What should I do? <laughs> ah, an upgrade plan. <laughs> I'm overwhelmed. What's this? Kingston. Templar key cunt. <laughs> oh, oh, I didn't say it. I didn't say it. The T did not come out of my mouth. I meant to say hunt, um, but I didn't say it. Oh, maybe we should go here. Let's go to Tortuga. Uh, yeah, he means end stream, come back in an actual <laughs> month. All right. Um, where's Havana? <laughs> Templar Keek. <laughs> oh, where's Havana? H. Oh, yeah, perfect. Okay, great. Let's go. Thank you. That's a great, a great advice. Templar culture. Uh huh. Uh huh. These are good chests. Megan, focus. Ooh. Oh. Oh. <laughs> okay, let's go here first. <laughs> I'm excited. Hi, Winter. Good to see you. No worries. 
we set up our fiber internet at our new house i'm so excited i also got champagne washer and dryer i'm so excited it was on a huge huge sale Hey, I caught myself. I didn't I didn't say the T. <laughs> Make for great decorations, guys. I can't afford it. Tell me I can't afford it. I can't afford art. Buenos dias, senor. Buenos dias. Ooh, I like this music. Oh, I have a mansion. What do I do there? What do I do in the mansion? <laughs> this is me. Why I could never be rich. What do I do in the mansion? Pineapple. Oh, benefits. Like what? Oh, this is a cool viewpoint. CM Climbs, thank you so much for being a voice of reason. <laughs> CM is my accountant. I don't need the treasure. I do not need the treasure. Warehouse first or assassin? Let's do the warehouse first. Oh, nice. Perfect. Easy peasy. I'm gonna jinx it. Oh god, that scared me. go up and get that guy. He's pissing me off. You're pissing me off, dude. Oh. Oh. Where'd he go? Oh! <laughs> oh, shit! Okay, you know what? I will give them that. That was awesome. That was awesome on their part. <laughs> Damn. Oh, 
Okay, wait. Please, I really need to craft this. But it's like never possible. Like, what? I can't stand straight. <laughs> That's so funny. Yes. Okay, great. <laughs> yeah, no, 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 no. Dude. No. Where's he going? You can't leave. Bro, what? He left. Well, he's. Okay, so I just have to steal it. Thank you. <laughs> Hell yeah. Yes, I did expect him to. Guys, don't mind me. I'm just I'm just looking. Oh shit, he's gonna see me. <gasps> nothing, nothing. Anonymous. I'm anonymous. Oh. Poor guys are coughing up on smoke. Oh! Hi, RMP. I'm loving it. I'm obsessed. Boom, 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 boom. Hell yeah, CM. Okay, now we are going to do the Templar thing. Yeah. 
Oh, but I really want this treasure. <laughs> Kit. Sapphire earrings for my wife back at home. Whatever. Yes! Get him! Mucha fuerza, poco seso. Yes, yeah, CC. Okay, I'll help you guys. Sorry. There you go. Right up the butt. Necesita ayuda, caballero. Necesita ayuda? Yes, I do. I do need help. Oh my god, I'm rich. <laughs> Not for long, but right now I'm rich. Okay, so I need 200 wood. Uh... <laughs> Mortar storage? Sure. Creo que ha sido un buen terreno. Creo que something. A girl! It's Rona, right? Can we? Looking for trouble, I assume. Hmm. So you haven't lost your charm. <laughs> And you're still boozy as a swilter. What do you want? I've come to warn you. Your life's in danger. Aren't you the crafty one? Whatever gave her away? <laughs> Possibly I had a hand in selling a sensitive document to one of those Templar chaps you're so fond of. Congratulations. Your mission was a success. How can I make amends? <sighs> you sober enough for target practice? Anything for a lady. <sighs> Help me kill these men. You little flirt. You little flirts. They're coming from everywhere. Come on, then. I've got more than enough powder to take care of them. Take a keg. Set a trap. Oh, I see. Cool. Oh, wait, wasn't there one here? Yes. Okay, okay. I just wanted to reload, my bad. Let me. There we go. I'm so sorry, okay? Why not set a powder keg for more boom? Honey, I am. I did. I was just kind of messing up a lot. Oh, 
Oh, it didn't even get the powder keg. Ugh. Where am I? <laughs> I'm so sorry. <laughs> I tried my best. So, is this your new persona? Sir Edward of Havana rescues damsels in distress. And does it suit me, Mopsy? <sighs> Better than your old personality. Really, Edward, why are you here? Yes. Well, there's a key. Most likely in the pocket of your Templar suitor. I need it. Really? And why don't I want this key for myself? Rona. I know you're no stranger to a man's boots, but the suit this key unlocks won't fit you. Oh. I'll tell you what. If I think of a chore that requires the help of an especially simple fellow... It's true. I'll let you he know. is. He is quite simple. <laughs> I mean, if the kegs are any indication. Um, I was worried to read the database entries because someone said spoilers. But I can read some now. He's so fast. I don't care. Bye, Fable. He's our simpleton. Exactly. Um... Ade, born to enslaved Ogoni parents in Yoruba, Ade was sold to the owner of a prosperous plantation before his teens. He remained on this plantation working the fields until his mid-teens, always scheming of ways to escape his predicament, but uneasy with the prospect of living life as a fugitive. Then fortune struck, giving Ade the sign he needed. At some point near his 16th birthday, a group of buccaneers raided the plantation, robbing it of raw cane, refined sugar, and as many reals that as they could find. Seeing in this an opportunity, Ade grabbed a crate of sugar and hauled it aboard one of the long boats the buccaneers had rowed ashore. Surprised to see a slave among them, the buccaneers were nevertheless thankful for the aid <laughs> and welcomed Ade among them. Ade sailed with this first group of men for many years, quickly learning the ways of a seaman, grateful for the chance to develop his own skills and chase his own passions. And though his life among buccaneers was not free of the usual bigotry of the era, Ade found the prejudice to be more confrontational than restrictive. Sad, he has to choose. In 1715, misfortune struck a cruel blow when the ship Ade was aboard struck a shallow sandbar near the port of Havana. The buccaneers, mostly British at the time, tried dress desperately to free the trapped vessel, but after catching sight of an approaching Spanish galleon, abandoned ship only to be torn apart by schools of circling bull sharks. Ade made peace with his fate and stood his ground. <laughs> Taken to Havana for questioning and inspection, Spanish authorities eventually decided to send Ade Wale to Spain, where they felt he would make an excellent interpreter, owing to his fluent command of Spanish, English, and French. Some weeks later, they loaded him into one of the galleons that made up their perennial treasure convoy en route to Seville. Um, let's do... Let's look at her. Daughter of Emmett and Elizabeth Scott, Caroline was born in Bristol to a prosperous family of merchants and civil servants. Given a modest education by her father, she furthered her own studies in her own way. Wait. Yeah, we read this. Yes, we read this. Known variously by different sources as Thatch, Teach, Thich, Tash, Titch, <laughs> Teach, Tack, <laughs> 
and more. We are fairly certain this Edward was born in or around Bristol and took to the sea at an early age, most likely in his teens. It is also speculated that he arrived in the West Indies quite soon after leaving England. If this was indeed the case, Ed Thatch would have seen his fair share of the War of Spanish Succession, a protracted fight between most of the empires of Europe that pitted Britain against royalist Spain and France. In these early years, from 1700 to 1713, he would have been a privateer, or at the very least, a merchant seaman, seaman. <laughs> doing his part for the crown queen Anne at the time. But with the Treaty of Utrecht bestowing peace upon a troubled Europe in 1713, Thatch and his fellow sailors would have found themselves far from home and out of work. They thus turned to piracy as a means of sustaining themselves. In the ensuing years, Thatch befriended a captain named Benjamin Hornigold and soon after joined his crew as quartermaster at some point between late 1714 and early 1716. <laughs> Settling in Nassau, uh, Thatch, Hornigold, and the rest of the flying gang, as these pirates called themselves, began cooking up schemes far larger than most pirates of the era dared dream. Wanting nothing less than a country of their own, they worked to turn Nassau into a place of liberty and freedom for all who desired an escape from the bonds of imperial rule. Mary. Of all the infamous West Indies pirates, Mary Reed stands out as one of the most mysterious and inscrutable. So she existed in real life. No one is sure when she was born with most speculation ranging over almost a decade between 1685 and 1695. According to Charles Johnson, a frequently unreliable source, <laughs> her mother began dressing Mary in boys' clothes from a very, very early age with the hope of passing her off as another man's son. Note, not sure how this will play with average audiences. Have we ever done a market survey on cross-dressers? In her teens, Mary evidently harnessed her skill for disguise to secure a job aboard a ship. Taking to sea, she worked her way forward until she found a position in the British Navy. Still dis disguised as a man, she saw action in battle, though owing to the conflicting reports of her birth, we cannot be certain of the battle. It was during these skirmishes that Mary met her first husband. First. So the author of the general history of pirates claims a Flemish soldier who had evidently fought beside her. But this union was not fated to remain intact, as Mary's husband was killed soon after their marriage. With few reasons to remain in Europe, Mary sailed for the West Indies. It is unclear what transpired in the years following, but it is almost certain that she resumed the practice of dressing as a man. We also assume Mary continued working aboard ships, improving her skills as a sailor and swordsman. By 1715 or 16, it was likely she had visited her fellow sailors in Nassau, though perhaps not for the same reasons. Okay, last one for now, Rona. Born in Scotland, Rona Dinsmore was made for adventure. After suffering, suffering the lows of a depressed household, her father absent and her mother an alcoholic throughout her childhood, Dinsmore left her home in Glasgow in her mid-teens. At 19, she found work amongst merchants in Bristol and remained at that post for nearly two years. By 21, Dinsmore was trapped in a terrible marriage. She fled again and sought refuge in Boston, where she remained for six months, before moving on to the warmer climes of Jamaica. There she found it exceedingly difficult to work among farmers, and finally took to the sea, ultimately finding her calling within the Assassin Brotherhood. Notes, rumored terrible marriage. Look at the facts. All her patterns after that are those of a con artist, even if her independence is a little inspiring. ML, shut up. Notes, anyone find confirmation of romantic ties to Hillary Flint yet? No, but there's lots of sarcasm. Notes, there's still room for love in that. The opposite of love isn't hate, it's indifference. Aw, you're a poet. See, that's exactly what I'm talking about. Okay, well, she's gay in my eyes.
we all okay here Have you reconsidered my offer, Rona? Yes. As I'm indisposed, and my sense of duty runs deeper than my pride, there's a situation I hope you can investigate. Go on. Mind, I said investigate a situation, <laughs> not create one. Yes, Mum. <laughs> what is it? A rash of thefts and mischief. Seems too convenient it started at the same time as these bureau attacks. Could you see what you can find out around the market? A boozy swill tab like me? Are you sure? I won't let you down. Oh. It would be hard to get much lower than this. Oh, oh, shit. I'm sorry! I was confused by the barrels! Bum, 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 bum. <laughs> Your high school English teacher was a pirate. fast oh shit oh what am i well he was fast as fuck boy he literally like teleported and i was so far away okay. There's a treasure map somewhere. Oh. This is more like it. Nice. Okay. And a sea shanty. pretty far well i am going to get this
I am Kamen Rider. I am. I've gotten a lot of money. It just goes to... It goes to, uh, upgrades. I've been really working hard. Okay, so you have to... Oh god, that's way too many. No, thank you. I've gotten two warehouses today, okay? I don't want anyone telling me what I need to be doing to make money. I literally got two warehouses today. Oh my god, it's a whole fucking Spanish military! this oh empty yeah because of me empty because of me hey be careful hey be careful why did you do that for Edward, pull yourself up by the bootstraps and make money. It seems like nobody wants to work these days. You just got to get your ass up and work. <laughs> okay, I'm back. Hey. Arms race. The same as seen it. It's a Managed to nab a pickpocket. Slyboots had a map. Something about storehouses and gunpowder. I did some research too. It's clear as day. The whole operation's run by that Templar scoundrel Hillary Flint. That's the same name from the map. He's using pickpockets to run an arms race. So Against that's her who? crush? Me. He's in the lead, I take it. Yes, but with your map, we can destroy his weapon stores to catch up. Let's waste no time. Romantic relations. I would love that. Good night. Love you back, London. Have a great sleep. Oh, wait. Um, let's get this one first. You with me? No.
No, you. Bars. Nice. Hey, Ludi. Hi, Naruto. Good to see you. Yeah. I need to get the shanty. But baby, hell yeah. It's like on brand for him. No! Why is everyone in their mom here? <laughs> He's so casual. It's so funny. Huh? No. No. I need the treasure. Yes. Good job. Come on. Come on. Yes. Nice. Okay. Now, back to my girl. One of my girls. One of my girls. One of my chicks. Nice, Sergio. I'm sorry. Sorry. My apologies. I'm not the person that just blew up all the explosives. A dad joke. A thousand pardons. It's not me. Um, why am I on books? No. I need to find a good dad joke for you. It's 
gonna be a good one. Fractured soul. It's <laughs> is is butt cheeks one word or should I spread them apart? <laughs> There's nothing wrong with me being up here. Why do you take so much offense? I don't understand. Just can you go? Oh. <laughs> Get off. Why can't I be on the rooftops? Go to bed. Wait, why am I canceled? <laughs> Why? Because of, <laughs> of that? There's nothing cancelable about spreading your butt cheeks. I would say the fact that you said it was cancelable because... That's cancelable. <laughs> because you're not being uh, body positive. I'm not... <laughs> body neutral. Sorry. Body accepting. <laughs> Anyways, I don't know why I thought that was so <laughs> instant ban. Departnered, deplatformed. Edward, we've reduced that Templar Cad Flint to a fraction of its power. <laughs> the only thing standing between you and your key now is Flint himself. You have an approach in mind? I'll engage him in combat. Wait, I thought Hillary was and a girl. You circle around carefully and, well, you know the rest. Suddenly squeamish, Rona. Can't quite bring yourself to kill him. This of is the not. worst moment of my life. I just don't want you to feel like I'm telling you what to do. I think that injury must have left you with a touch of fever. <laughs> Can we go now? Oh. Let's. Um, oh, so it's abusive husband. Fight. I thought it was a she girl. I thought Hillary was a girl. About like the cock of the walk. Admit it, Rona. Deep down, you like the walk of that cock. I can arrange to have you in Thumakins if Flogan's too kind, Kenway. Oh. What? Random NPC, hey! The most is the fox hunt. Of course, there's plenty of other game to be found. One I'll distract him. You circle around me. Hey, Flint! Ha! Not much of a shot, are you, Flint? Oh, okay, okay. No pictures, please! No pictures, please! Jesus. What did you expect? I would come in person. You overestimated. Yeah. Shoot him! Kill, 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 kill! Stab, 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 stab! Human shield! He's a ginger? I knew we would end in fire. Oh. But I always thought our positions ginger. would be reversed. <laughs> She'd have died happier, knowing there was... One less assassin in the world. <laughs> what a pity. We oh. could never fight together. Ew. The correct side of things. I don't like him. Would, uh, you two like a moment alone? <laughs> no. Oh. <laughs> it's too late. <laughs> He's just in this memory. <laughs> Dude. 
terms all used up. <laughs> Let the memory of him be locked away for good. Yeah, that wasn't a very pleasant person. How did you make it in her assassin, like, daydream? Sir. <laughs> I love him. Yes. That's one more key, baby. Wait, I only need one more? What? Oh, oh. Oh. Sorry. Um. Where am I? Interesting. I feel like I'm doing this really early. Hey, Smurf. Yeah, I know some people were upset about like not the in they took away the integrity of those death things. I'm like, what do you expect? They're making it different. Edward Kenway, this freaking assassin we all love is not going to hold the back of their heads romantically and go requiescat in pace. He doesn't speak Italian. What? <laughs> or Latin or anything like that. Yo, I don't know what you guys expect. I like that it's all different depending on... <laughs> okay, I'm sorry. I just ran to my room. Yes, like I like that it. Oh, oh, so. Oh my God, that stretch. Oh wait, he's not an assassin. I keep forgetting. <laughs> That's so funny. Um, I'm gonna add it to my fleet. Oh, nice. Okay. I'm so sorry. Which one did I just get? Pineapple? A brick? I don't know. I needed a ship. Hi, Hetty. Good to see you. Tonight we are victorious. Champagne flowing over us. Tonight we are victorious. Ugh. Brendan Yuri. Oh, 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 oh. American dreams. Exactly, Paper. Does he still stream on Twitch? Also, his voice is degenerating. <laughs> Caleb and I were comparing him to Haley Williams of Paramore and how humble she has been with Paramore. And, like, literally, we are all Paramore. You know, like, she's been so adamant about 
making sure that Paramore is more than just her, even though she's the lead singer. I just love her. Yes, and like going to the concert last night, it was like the most diverse crowd and she even commented on it. She was like, I'm so lucky to perform to such diverse crowds. And I'm like, honey, it's because you, you, like you create a safe space. And it was, it was very different from going to Taylor Swift. I felt like I was in a sorority. I was like scared for my life with all the white women there. <laughs> and like, yes, I know I contributed to it, but they're like, Taylor Swift's audience was entirely white woman, entirely. And I was like, I'm gonna get hazed. Like I'm terrified of Swifties. Um, so like to go to a Paramore concert, everyone is like queer with like different colored hair and um, <laughs> and just like so many different types of people it was the best. So I always ask myself, how do I feel after AC2 story. Yeah, it is pirate adventure. Yes, she is. I'm I'm selfishly glad that I got to like enjoy her concert before she announced she was dating him. Um I've always struggled with her. Always. She's she's a capitalist, but I always thought like she was my capitalist. But this, for me, like, I'm just kind of, I'm very put off by her. Good night, Alyssa. Happy birthday again. But Haley Williams is my wife. She was captivating. I love her so much. I almost threw up seeing that dude. know what her problem is <laughs> I don't know what her problem is she's very calculated individual and she's even admitted it and her brand of white feminism is just not it it's just not it I need money. I need money. Harpoon strength. Apple pie. Oh my God. I saw Florence in the machine in this like, um, are you talking about Florence in the machine? I saw her at this kind of festival. She wasn't headlining. It was like a charity concert type thing. And Muse was like the last person. She went on right before Muse. She totally stole the show. She was barefoot and she was just running across the stage. And she was like, she was so captivating and wonderful. So fun um, and magical. And then Muse gets on and don't get me wrong. I love Muse, you know, I do, but they get on and it's like, I don't even know how they could follow her because she's so amazing. They were just like in sunglasses and just stood there like playing their guitars and singing. Oh, Stevie Nicks. Hell yeah. I saw Lizzo live. Amazing. Amazing. I'm going to put on his robes. No, I didn't Common Rider, but that sounds so fun. Oh, I love Evidence, Evanescence. Oh, Hosea. Yes. Where am I? <laughs> I always do this. Oh, I'm in Havana. Let's just sail, tail, take wheel, sail to sea. And let me look at the forts. I saw Lizzo before she got really big. 
And she captivated everyone. Like, no one knew who she was. But we were like, this is amazing. And I remember, like, uh, looking up her music afterwards. Where am I going? Where am I going? This way. I do, Hetty. Running down to Cuba. Yeah, we got this one. Can you get me a roll too? A yeah. vegetable roll? Yeah. Yes. So I'm going to get moving boxes because it's right next to Walmart. Caleb is crazy. He's been doing so much for the move. He's been doing so many tasks, taking care of the dogs. Round of applause for Caleb. Oh. I've been taking naps and <laughs> dancing to bear more. Well, I just played Zelda for two hours. So. That's good. I'm glad that you relaxed because you're, you're kind of scaring me. It's too many tasks. It's way too oh. many tasks. Well, Look at uh, all those clabs. Hi, hi, paper. <laughs> hi, Sergio. Oh, thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank Don't you. Don't you love his shirt? I got it. I was talking concert. about how uh, safe the Paramore crowd felt and yeah. compared to when we thought we were going to get hazed at a fraternity of the Taylor Swift concert. I thought I was going to get like. Uh, smothered with glitter or something yeah it just here's your reminder to do everything you can to make your spaces even if they're smaller you know safe for for all different types of marginalized groups because it's worth it like that was just the best energy and it was just the best it, it was awesome and he wore a coheed shirt and like we can tell Coheed and Cambria also has a really good fan base because yeah, people kept being like, like oh, nice. A nice Coheed shirt. Except yeah. it was her Coheed shirt that she got when we yeah. saw them last year. But they were like, did you go to the show last week? Because there was apparently a Coheed show last week. In yeah, Atlanta. we yeah. Um, we got COVID and we, that was our first concert, right? Since? or No. We, well, Taylor Swift. No, 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 no. That Coheed concert was the first one we went to oh, after yeah. the pandemic there was one we left because it was in this tiny room and they ended up like no one was wearing masks and we just straight up left because we were like this is horrible 
but with the Coheed one, we wore masks. We were very dil diligent, and we got COVID regardless, so we had PTSD. <laughs> <laughs> and we couldn't go see them again. Um. <laughs> All the women. Uh. Wait, what? Oh, with the. the oh, the Taylor Swift. <laughs> we're trying to make the best of it. Oh, it that fun. little capitalist hoe. Sorry. <laughs> I had a blast last night though. I was freaking out. Even though the person standing next to me was like jamming me in a corner. I know. I was like trying to dance, but I was just like crammed, like just dancing with my arms. <laughs> nice, Peggy. I bet. Oh my God. That's something that Republicans will never understand. That drag shows are literally the best yes. energy I'm gonna, ever. I'm going to walk him. Okay. Puppy says, I am the star. Let a beard grow. And you play girl. <laughs> Thank you, Hetty. Uh, the problem is I can't beard. grow any facial hair. Um, it's trash. It's all on his head. I try. It's all on his head. Yeah, I'm literally incapable. Love you too. Okay, I'm sick of this one. Yes, paper! I love that. Um, <laughs> voice is high. I love the. I love that they're singing this when we haven't even infiltrated the fort. Like, guys, keep the energy up. We still have to kill people up here. Knock, knock, please let me in. Exactly. I feel like I'm really role playing as him because guess what? We're just kicking open chests. Welcome back, Tan. Okay, do you want to Do you want to surrender? No, I don't think so. Oh, for sure, Janess, that's so true. Pirates are for the gays.
That was pretty cool. That was pretty cool. What's this? Oh, legendary ship. I don't think I can do that. Naval contract. No. I want hunter ships. When am I ever going to get 200 wood? So true. Yay! Oh. I bet, Maru. I bet. I don't think I've seen one yet. Oh, I see. Oh. My bad. I might shoot a fire barrel. What? Okay, I was like, what are they doing? This is fun. Yes. Oh no. No. Oh my god. Oh, thank god. Nippity bopty, nobody can stop me. Him spitting the facts, and nobody can stop that any war. T h i r t y s e v e n m o n t h s. I love you, Maggie Meg. Thank you so much, Bree, for the thirty-seven months. I love you back. I really do. Thank you. I want to do hazardous. Prepare. All is well. It's been a very good stream. Oh, this this one can take it. Okay. Well, I still will send that. Right? No. You got it. You got it. You don't even need me. Go, King. Sorry, do all ships have to be girls? Can I have boy ships? Or is that misgendering the ships? Oh. What about non-binary ships? Um. Hmm. Yeah, because it could be like I've seen names that are not just for women. Save the children. Oh, well, we've done that. Bodie McBoat face. I guess we'll save the children. Sorry, I'm very angry. Anyways, 
That was fun. Should I do this? Where are you going? Five. We've captured a ship carrying valuable cargo. Um, I don't think that this is for me, right? That's really high difficulty. Five out of five. Pineapple. Can I do this? Oh, okay. No. No is a full sentence. <laughs> Captain has the helm. Give me some speed. Should I just do this? More sail! Full sail! Load on all the sail we have! Ooh, a storm. I feel like I need to... Upgrade my ship more. A storm! Damn it! Damn it to heck. Oh, the hull. Yeah, so I need wood. Well, let's head in this direction if there are any ships around with wood, then I'll get them. There we go. Perfect timing. Uh, this is not an ally, right? That's not an ally, Pineapple. No, okay, good. <gasps> I love the colors after a storm. <laughs> Very homophobic. Okay, let's go. Goodbye, fare you well. <laughs> That's hilarious. Oh. <laughs> Oh shit. Ghost the Royals are top. Fall off. Hello, Lil Down. Take some win. Yes. Look at these colors. Beautiful. The blue sea and the pink sky. Are you kidding me? One more. Yes! I didn't even have to get over there. What should we do? Let's...
this one. Even if we salvage it. I love that. Who did it? What? What? Do you really want to pick a fight with me right now, dude? Like, okay. Cannon ready. Round on every inch of sail. I'm full along. Man your sheets. Hey! It is so fun to plunder. So fun. time that'd be so cool salty damn are they working on that shit because that's awesome okay i'm gonna release the wheel i they take the wheel take it from my hands because i'm gonna play my mini game Called Kenway's fleet. I'm not beating my meat. I'm simply playing battleship. Ah, they take the wheel. Um, is this good? Is this ship good? Okay, solid. Oh, yes. Um, this one isn't good. Well, I'm going to add one more dock. Just because I have enough. <laughs> add a dock and then salvage. No. <laughs> I don't know, Steph. I don't know. <laughs> yeah, these suck. Come on. Wait, I have one more. <laughs> you know, the gemstones are just like hiding beneath the wood. Oh, I got them all. Okay. Um, oh, let's sell. I'm on a roll today. Wood, I have almost 200. Not almost, but still. The real gems are the ma friends we made along the way. Yeah! True! Unfold mains, let's move! Sing, bitches.
Cap, trim the yards off the wind. Muzzle your tops, my drums. I had wood. I need wood. <laughs> Don't judge me. Sing, bitches. <laughs> Easy peasy. He's oh, someone just fell. What? Four with one shot. Mhm, mm mhm. Mm I gotta go to the ear doctor. The ear doctor won't save you now. Okay. I'm gonna salvage the ship, but you know. Yeah. Okay. Get the main spree. All sail. She'll take it. Loose tops, loose gallons, and royal. Wait, wait, wait. Who's that? I think that's what I just got. Okay. Anyways. I don't like this. Beautiful. Me, Janess, me. I'll keep my bangs for this moment. I dug his grave with a silver spade. I dug his grave with a silver spade. What is happening over there? Drama. Oh, it's Florida. That was close. Florida's always struggling. He almost ran over Florida. My apologies. That's a furious Florida trip. No, I didn't know. I didn't think that I could climb them. Sing again. Rises. No. No. No, too sad. That's not funny, drunken. I don't think that's a very funny joke. Hi, Marissa. Thank you, Queen. There are just some things that are way too sensitive and real right now. Perfect timing. Yes, that's an ally, so let's be aware. Hey, <laughs> Queen is pinned right now. Oh, 
Where the hell? Oh, it might be this. I guess let's go. Hey, old bonnet. Flying your own flag at last. Yes. Yes, Blackbeard cut me loose, sadly. Time to have a go at this myself. Well, that's grand. <laughs> yes, it's for the best, I think. <laughs> I should have some wild stories when next we meet. Oh. Edward, your constant friendship has been my most treasured find on these seas. Well above gold and silver and rum, I, I prize the courage you've inspired in me this year. Thank you, sir. A fair good morrow to you. He better not die. He better not die. Otherwise, I'm banning all of you. Are you not lost? No! Are you not wanted by your wives? Here goes the performance. Families. It's I'm like Batman. Countrymen. How else to explain your government's complete disinterest in your well-being? Hostages! For sense. Even has a different voice. These were my only terms. Oh. She just wants medicine. Yeah. Six days of pure fucking science. So I must conclude that you men are the pariahs of Charlestown, and I would profit better by using your organs for chum and your bones for char. My Christ! This is my predicament. To kill you, or to press you into my servant. Mm. It's a decision I'll make hardly, but not with remorse. Ahoy, Edward. What the hell are you doing, man? All of Charleston can see this mess. This is the idea. Out of range, but well in sight. So where's the medicine? We sent a party ashore to partner with the governor. That were a week ago. No noise, since. I'll handle it. <laughs> Give me a day. Okay. All they want is medicine for their country. It's just... It's crazy. Ooh. There's movement up ahead. Is it soldiers? His crew. Oh, oh that's interesting. Of a hurry. I propose we follow. Else they spring something. Tailing on a ship. We're tailing on a ship, guys. More sail. All we've got. What's your thinking? Blackbeard's been at this eight days already. So it's a good bet. Someone out there has prepared the medicine. Just in case. Ah, but they're stalling. Thinking of ways to avoid big towns. Aye, so let's find where they've gathered and hope for the best. Vincent, catch the wind. Careful, Captain. We're drifting close to a watchtower. I see. There's another watchtower. I see. Careful with the banks. Cannot pass them on the captain. 
There is no other way. There's always Just another way. Shine 11 oh, gives you the tier 1 subscription to Half Blood Tara. Shin, thank you for gifting that sub to Tara. Thank you. Ah, oh, this is actually so cool. I'm trying. Oh, I see. Oh my god, you fucker! No. It's okay. Everything's okay. Only be thankful this ship remains anchored and hasn't torn a path into the art of Charlestown. They'll be hunted down eventually. Every last one of them. And weren't y'all just talking about syphilis?
I think I'm going too far. Maybe not. Almost there. Good. Captain White. Oh shit. Oh god. I am anonymous. You for the checkpoint. That's actually very nice. Hello. Is that radar yonder? The very same. Then speed along. You're Hello, expected. shame. And you know how Welcome. Yeah. Oh, right. It took him. <gasps> it took him. I told you. Just throw. For God's sake, throw. Oh, good. I told you there was something. Didn't oh. I tell you? oh, God. Let's just get out of here. I'm glad I saw that. Yet to kill or maim any of the captives, near as we can tell. Perhaps it's time to to surrender. I've been entrusted with the affairs of the town, and I oh. To surrender. I've been entrusted with the affairs um, of the town, don't and I do be not suspicious. to the demands of a pirate, no matter how fierce his reputation. Yes, sir. As long as the supply key is with me, no. I'm sorry, there's like nowhere for me to hide. I know, pirates! warning. The ship's here! Yes. Pirates! Fall back to the mansion! To the mansion! Oh! <laughs> Imagine slipping! Imagine slipping! I'm dying. Oh, okay. Can you imagine? Like, you're like, oh my god, pirates! And just like the coolest pirate you've ever seen. And you run towards him and then you just slip into the water. <laughs> Kill him! Kill him! He's going for the captain! Mm hmm. I am actually. Go up. Yeah. Oh, shit. This is so cool.
that was pretty cool though. You sleep darts on crocodiles. Oh, okay. I, see. I think I was supposed to do that earlier. Okay, um. I'm not doing as well. Okay. Oh, all right. Okay. So cool. Oh shoot, okay, I see. If I have to do it again, I'm understanding a bit more. I don't under He's in. Um, okay. Ooh, this is kind of challenging. I like it. Let's go, let's go. No mistakes this time. Blackbeard made you as good an offer as ever a man got from any pirate. You might curse his methods, but medicine was all he wanted. And now he'll get it. Mm hmm. I. You should have bartered, mate. Yeah, seriously. Should have bartered. He has returned, Captain! What's the take? Two crates. And the means for mixing additional doses. Uh, that's right thinking. Precious little of that these days. You hear that, Mr. Rags? My young friend returns with offerings and so saves your scrawny mm. neck. <laughs> Will you not thank him? <laughs> we should quit these waters, Thatch. The governor, he's bound to muster more soldiers. You go on ahead. I, I got some business in the north. You're done, aren't you? Giving up on us. <gasps> on NASA. Why? Look, lad. I'm late into my fourth decade on this earth. Aww. And if I don't find some means to make the fifth quiet and cozy voyage, I'd rather sink to the devil's doorstep than call myself Captain. Another year. Oh. Now we'll meet again, lad. Oh. In this world. Or the one below. Yeah. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Who had time to fucking skin a crocodile? What is that? That's precious and sad, but. Wow, he's late 40s. You have a minute? I'm on my way upstairs. IDVA wanted to talk with us about putting together a trailer using some of the footage you've been recording this past month. Take your time. I'll meet you by the elevator. I will be hacking computers if they pop up, so I will be taking my time. Are you kidding? 
That's... That's scary. What? What's under review? The security system. Are you ready? He's waiting for us. <gasps> okay. Sorry. <laughs> yes. I just watched some of your footage from this week. It's amazing. Blackbeard was mental. Mental. And we all got so excited that we started talking about this idea for a trailer about him. <laughs> Maybe start with him drinking. That's funny. Some pirates telling a story. Then we cut to him leaping across the deck of his boat and, sorry, his ship, not boat, but jumping around the deck of his ship, swinging from ropes and fighting like a devil. I mean, obviously, we're going to have to manipulate some of the existing footage to get it looking good, but it could be great. I'm getting a shiver in my timbers just thinking about it. <laughs> sorry. Try not to cringe challenge. I mean, it was it was a bomb trailer. Bonjour, ça va? I hope we're not late. No, you can go right. I'm Melanie. I saw you just walked in. I need a few minutes with you alone. Oh. Cecilia is on the phone and we're discussing the Kenway project. Oh, yes, of course. Sorry about this. I'll call you when we're ready. Oh. Shouldn't be long. Hello? Oh. Hello? Do you have a second? Of course you do. Head to the waypoint on your map. I have another job for you. I'd oh, like to shit. link all the cameras in the building to a central yes. system, but most aren't calibrated correctly. Head to the right of Olivier's office. Uh, and if the receptionist complains, act like you're using the toilets. I've already been here, but sure. Another locked door. Not a problem. Voila. You now have level two security clearance. Yeah. Not bad. These first few weeks. Find the cat. I'll update your communicator. Oh, yes. No. Oh, this is an interesting security measure. It looks like you need to find the right combination of numbers to adjust the wave. Easy enough, right? Pick a number selector, then change its value. Once you find the right combination of numbers, you should get access. Good night, Janice. Sorry if that came up wrong. We are not trying to be a bottleneck here, but we just don't have the resources right now to do two times the research. Finding that balance is your priority. Your entertainment products are simply a means to pay the bills for larger and more important work. Mm. That's the way the world works. Hmm? Dirty money buys clean hospitals. You get it? Oh. We're on board, Letitia, rest assured. We have our best employee working on this, but it will take time. That means you. Good. And thank you. The both of you. I look forward to seeing what you deliver. Yeah. Okay. Looking forward to it. Bye bye. I don't like her. About what that. a Templar. It's a little too early for that kind of abuse, huh? Come on. Yeah, we are the best employee. So, what's next? <laughs> as the lady says focus on the observatory i will be plundering ships you can't stop me assassins templars <laughs> crazy talk i'm curious about this shareholders meeting though 
How about you break into Olivier's office and see if you can find his schedule? Oh, what? You don't like that idea? Well, how about I blow the fucking whistle on you, hacker? I own you! <laughs> what I mean is, I don't want to ruin your life. So, do as I say. Now. What is happening? The this is... They're unhinged with this modern day stuff. What the fuck? Wow. Pretty. You can't waltz into Olivier's office through the front door, so I've opened another route. Up we go. Did it's you know quite that pretty. Durgo was run by Templars? Oh, yeah. Sounds like crackpot stuff, I know. But then again, the moon landing was faked, right? So, anything's possible. Um... Mm. All right. Either you walk through that door or throw yourself off the terrace. Those are your options. Is it just his humor? Is oh, he just well like done, kiddo. Find dark his computer, humor? Make it snappy. We're looking for the shareholders meeting schedule. It's worth a lot of money to us. Oh shit. Okay. Oh. Bye, Salty. Salute. As most of you know, I'll be attending the Chicago shareholders meeting from the 15th to the 17th, and they'll want to see our progress with the Kenway line. The small amount of data we have already gathered is incredible and we anticipate even more amazing finds in the near future. The events and people we have seen so far make us confident that the complete experience will be one of the most eye-opening explorations of piracy ever seen. It will take quite a bit of work to scrub the data of objectionable and classified material, but we already have some incredibly promising footage. At the same time, Abstergo Entertainment will be announcing a closed beta for our new consumer cloud interface app, sexy name, <laughs> forthcoming. Edward Kenway's virtual pirate experience will be the first complete product on offer. Welcome back, Jackson. And the first of its kind anywhere, an immersive interactive pirate experience drawn from actual historical data. Internal tests of our consumer cloud app have been encouraging and we anticipate it will be ready in time for the next holiday season, if everything goes according to plan. So this leads us to a broader question. What other experiences would we like to offer? What other historical periods and locations can we explore? Judging by our current rate of data retrieval, our capacity to produce, and our understanding of consumption trends. Wait, so like, they actually turned into this though. Executives at, at Abstergo Industries have given me the goal of producing one complete virtual experience per annum. Was this like some of the smaller devs complaining within the game? Like, were they warning us where Ubisoft was headed? Because weren't they churning out one a year? In addition to smaller offerings, as our research shows, this includes books, recordings, films, and any other transmedia offerings. They're memeing on themselves. That is so funny. A second related question is this. Does Sample 17 contain enough compelling data to sustain our current commitment to it? Or should we make a request to Abstergo Industries for additional archive data? Remember that data from Sample 1 pro proved fruitful enough to create our liberation product. It's very likely that research into samples 2 through 16 would bear surprising fruits as well. Thoughts? Hello all, thanks for opening the discussion. Just a brief heads up. 
I've been the Sample 17 project director for over a year now, and my team and I have been able to cobble together a rough list of the most interesting time periods available to us through this single genetic sample. Italian Renaissance, Ottoman Empire, American colonies, war for the independence, New England and American West. Okay, so wait, <laughs> Holy Land slash Crusades, Egypt and Northern Africa, Japan, French Revolution, Napoleonic Wars, Taiwan, Summer of Love, American Pacific Coast. This is just a small sample of potential options. Yeah, I can imagine the crunch had to be so bad and like the people writing these like emails and stuff are obviously the ones who are being overworked like those devs and so it almost seems like a, like a cry for help that the, the higher ups didn't even think about i don't know however despite sample 17's rich heritage we should not limit ourselves to this alone if we have concrete leads elsewhere for instance, quite a few men from all sides of my family fought in both world wars, and I even have a great-great-grandfather who fought in the American Civil War. This is... Ugh. Going this route is a little more costly and time-consuming since the data has not been sequenced, but it could be rewarding in the long run. In short, if anyone has any confirmed connections to interesting historical events, periods, or cities, or knows of people who do, please share. Number two, participated in the trial of Jean oh that was what we hacked into and found right oh my god okay all right all good points Mel a word of caution though sample 2 comes from the late Dr. Warren Biddick himself collected at some point in the early 80s when he was a young engineer working at Abstergo Industries so it's tempting as a um, wait, is that Joan of Arc? Yeah, Joan of Arc. Experience sounds, I'm not sure if Sergo Industries would be too keen on letting us rummage around in Dr. Vidic's DNA. It's just a sensitive topic. Okay, so he... It's sensitive for Vidic, but it's not sensitive for Desmond? Like you understand, you understand that messing with someone's freaking DNA is sensitive and it's weird. Oh my God. <laughs> Francois Garneau, noted que 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 Quebecois historian and poet. Exciting, right? A possible lead? Smiley. Winky face? He had the nerve to put a winky face in a professional business email? <laughs> I would die. I, can't, I feel like I always want to put smiley faces, but I'm like, I can't seem too unprofessional, but I also don't want to seem like a bitch. Oh, donor 17. But... Okay. Yeah, I still think they're living in kind of a willful ignorance because we were able to find that information so easily, like the video of them taking his body. And so I'm still judging them um, for not asking questions. And it all feels weird and fake and forced. Let's avoid digging into any modern periods unless we find something incredibly compelling because as Fun as a World War II setting might sound. Did my eye did I did my eyes just read that? As fun as a World War II setting might sound, we do well to avoid any sudden tings with vehicles, cars, motorcycles, helicopters, tanks. Why, you may ask? Because our research has shown that memory imprinting in individuals is actually hampered by the semi-catatonic state most people enter when driving for medium and long periods of time. And this makes data retrieval somewhat more difficult. Oh my god. We don't want to go through the effort of coding extra animus features just for the sake of digging up memories of people driving around in cars. Olivier, haha. <laughs> Quebec City is beautiful, but without pirates, ninjas, or zombies, I'm not sure how well a story about a historian <laughs> would sell. Hey. 
Also, keep in mind, Simple Sport in 16 might be off limits, too. While doing my own research last month, I caught wind of some exciting characters buried in these gene samples. But as soon as I started digging, I was told by people far, far above me to stop. Very odd, but not surprising, I suppose. AE has a lot of active military contracts, and I assume these had something to do with that. I didn't push back 16, subject 16. As far as my own, if anyone is interested, my great grandfather was friends with Hemingway. <laughs> oh my God. The way that they're just like, well, my great, great, great grandpa. <laughs> is our lunch meeting on site or off? Yes, as much as I love the lost generation, I think our first few virtual experiences will need to be a little more action oriented. So wars and major combat operations are always a good starting point or any periods of intense conflict, really. As for pirates, ninjas and zombies, we could easily accommodate the first two, but zombies are a bit, how do you say, ahistorical? Too bad, really. <laughs> My great grandmother <laughs> were instant worked alongside Eamon de Valera and Michael Collins for many years during the Irish War for Independence, so it wouldn't be difficult to sequence that small segment of my own genetic merit memories for our purposes. Olivier, actually there is a factual basis for zombies, <laughs> or zombification anyway. Read Hurston's book on Haiti and the strange voodoo practice there. It may not be Hollywood style zombie magic, but it's creepy nonetheless. In Liberation, Aveline came into contact with a voodoo Hungans. If we dug further into that, I wonder what we could find. Her magentor Agate was into some weird stuff. <laughs> Offsite, there's a new vegetarian place I want to try. No, <laughs> this is so chaotic. Sorry to be a, a dissenter, but couldn't we be using this technology to educate, not pl placate? I mean, theoretically, we have all of human history to explore, all of our achievements, and brightest moments so it's a little disheartening to hear we need to focus on wars and conflicts and violence who's this comma um i like you uh it's not that i'm against violence <laughs> no, no no don't get me wrong like it's not that i'm not against it's not that i'm against violence it's just that vi oh <laughs> violence isn't terribly interesting in bulk that's all. There's so much more nuance to life. I think we could explore that. So what if we found the memories of someone who worked with Albert Einstein or Charles Darwin, Marie Curie, moments where humans showed their very best potential? Okay, come on. Until oily, humorless university professors start paying us eight-figure fees to research the reification of normative gender signifiers in pre-colonial India, why don't we stick to the shit that sells? Evan, I'm talking Jack the Ripper. Okay, wait, but that would be really cool. That would be really cool. I'm talking about guillotines. Mm, I think one does take place in the French Revolution. Robespierre and Napoleon Bonaparte in the French Revolution. I'm talking about Billy the Kid and Wyatt. I'm talking about Genghis Khan and the Mongols killing a city of millions in the span of a long summer weekend. Action, blood, adventure, conflict. Because we're not going to earn back one-tenth of the money we have poured into this reliving the memories of the guy who sat next as he bit his... You sneaky bastard. A pirate through and through. Yes. Now, Hackers. Get down to the lobby. There's a courier waiting. Yeah, that's right. I've been planning this for a few hours. Now, wait. The receptionist. Hold on. I'll try something. Why do you have all those weapons there? Oh, no. As gullible as ever. Now, hurry down to the lobby before I remotely detonate your earpiece. <laughs> Don't even think about ratting me out. My tracks are covered. Yours ain't. Okay. I wasn't thinking of it. Like 
be a lingerie. I practiced. I think you pulled it a little too long. Oh, come on. It's not encrypted code, for God's sakes. It's just a bloody coffee. Oh, hooray! It's our old friend. <laughs> hey there. I just got a call about picking up another transfer. Oh, You said you were here to see me. Yes, that is one of the perks. Let's see it. Hmm. A conference in Chicago. Very nice. Thanks for this. We'll be in touch. Ciao, Rebecca. Text me. Stuff it, Text Hastings. Text me! <laughs> exactly. Well done, friend. Very well done. Apologies for my temper tantrum there. You are with the good guys, I promise. We'll keep you safe. Trust me. Go on back to work. We'll be in touch. Okay. You are with the good guys. Interesting. Um... Well, that's where I'm going to end today. Yeah, that was eventful. I'm interested in what Letitia... I'm interested in learning more about Letitia, but I have a feeling it's just going to be like any other Templar. Um, and I do think it's interesting that he said, we are the good guys, we are the good guys, because in the past... Assassin's Creed games we have oh hello um we have been figuring out like who's the good guy is it really as simple black and white as Templars bad Assassin's good so I think it's interesting that that was emphasized um I also just love learning more about Blackbeard and I do love these games because um I grew up in a very like sheltered way and like moving um constantly across the globe and i'm have gaps in like my knowledge of history especially like world history and stuff so it's really nice to be learning as i go um and i really loved learning about blackbeard and his performances because all i really knew was <laughs> uh like <laughs> wait was blackbeard even in pirates of the caribbean i don't know just all the stereotypes so i think it's interesting that he it was like a performance like he was an actor um to get what he needed for the safety of his crew and within the context of this game his country but it's interesting i know it's not all historically accurate but i don't know I just think it's just a great way for me to learn and get a better idea. Hey, Mr. Buggles.